Okay, so I just made myself some house tabs, uh, just in time to realize I don't have- oh, never mind. I was about to say I don't have any bank space. I do have bank space, it's just it's taken up with a whole bunch of rubbish. Uh, don't need them. But yeah, uh, I'm gonna have to reorganize my bank. Yay! This, this is gonna be another level. The reason I got myself to this one is because now that I've got this, I can use the crystal saw to boost those three levels to make myself a treasure chest. Because I'm fairly sure I made a clip about this, but as you can see my bank is getting very full. So I'm going to make myself a treasure chest so that I can start emptying it out uh, into there. I can only make a teak one at this point, so I can only put easy and medium clue items in there. Uh, but that's all right for the moment because then that, that'll still get a few items out of my bank Okay, so I'm fairly sure I have that but we just got another armor page uh, I Can never remember which armor page I have but I'm fairly sure if I don't have this one then this is completing the armor book Right, where is it? Okay, so yeah, as you can see I've got three different armor pages is this one I have For God's sake. Oh, no what do I need? I need four. Okay. Okay, so I got an elite clue scroll and the Sherlock step in it is to catch a shark. So I'm not currently at the right level to be able to do that. I need 71 to be able to boost for it. So I'm going to do some fishing at some point so that I can try and do this elite because I don't want to drop it. Alright, so yeah, I'm, I'm, still, I'm still here. I caught myself 38,000 Karambonji. Uh, this is because I just I ran out and I was fishing crown ones and I need to level my fishing uh, If you can remember back to episode 29 and 30. This is what I was doing when I was Recording uh, doing the editing so this is gonna be fun to see where which episode this actually ends up in see how far behind I am a little random clip out of nowhere, but um, This is the first time I've actually seen a raids 2 pet That looks pretty cool not gonna lie, little spider Ursula. Uh, another quick update, but just before I go to bed. Uh, but Solo never just reminded me uh, that the enchantment room uh, fix is actually live now. I didn't think it was live yet, so I was gonna wait to get Bones to Peaches, but since that is now live, I could just do it, well, any time really, because bots don't ruin the enchantment room anymore. Alright, so I'm gonna do a uh, mage training arena tomorrow, uh, which means I need to make myself quite a few more uh, runes. So I got myself the boosts to make myself some more glories, because like, I, I don't want to do this with just three glories. This will take me up to ten total, uh, and I think that's enough. Okay, so I've made enough nature runes. I need about 2,000, I think, and I'd made 2,000 about 1.5k rune crafting XP ago. Uh, but I thought, you know what, let's just finish the level off with nature runes, because you may as well have some spare nature runes, which means I will be one level off uh, 59, which is double cosmics. And there we go, 58. Uh, and I shall be moving on to making cosmics now. I have made 1600 cosmics, I've got 2000 natures, so I have enough runes. Uh, I'm fairly sure I definitely have enough laws. I didn't actually need to craft any of those, thankfully, because that is awful. Uh, but yeah, so I've got enough of those, so I'm probably gonna bust out at least Bones to Peaches tomorrow, maybe, uh, maybe Infinity Boots if I can be bothered. Okay, I know I said that the plan was gonna be to go do uh, made training arena and that is still the plan but I think getting myself stamina's would be incredibly beneficial so I'm gonna try and get myself to stop running away from me uh, I don't know how much this is gonna cost I don't know if it works with grimy herbs uh, so I don't know if I'm if I'm gonna have to clean them and then do that but let's see do I have enough combine don't think you've got any what oh make them finish potions okay so I need to clean them first uh, clean. Is it worth cleaning them? 200 coins. That's a lot. Fuck it. Wait, what? Does she not clean noted? What? Okay, so I've cleaned all my herbs now. Uh, let's 
make these into unfinished potions. Do I have enough money? Yeah, nice. Oh, and I, I do know that I haven't collected from miscellanea, but I want to try and leave that for as long as I can, so... Uh, I won't go collect from it unless I use all of these and I still can't make staminas. Okay, and once I've built this, this will be everything in the campsite built. Uh, I don't actually know why I did this, but I did. Uh, also, I'm fairly sure that now I've done this, there's a chap I can talk to, I think it's this guy, and he'll give me some fossils. Uh, yeah, there we go. Nice. Uh, I just did a maze. Look what I got. 4,000 feathers and 4,000 coins. That's... Like, it's, like 4,000 feathers, I'm not going to complain about that. That's pretty good. I, I need to buy a lot of feathers anyway. How many do I have? I've got... Th yeah, I was running out. Uh, yeah, I'm fairly sure all of the feathers I've got have been from maze randoms, which is pretty good. And then 4k coins. You can't complain with cash. Can't complain with cash. Right, I've just been playing around with my bank, I'll be honest. Uh, and I found these eggs. And I'm fairly sure you use these on here and you get bird's nests. And prayer XP. Ooh. 100 prayer XP. Hang on, can I do this? Okay, no, I have to use each one. Uh, is it just nests you get? Hey, can't complain about nests. Alright, so I am still clearing my bank out, and because I'm clearing my bank out, I came here to use up my installed heads. Uh, I, uh, I don't know why I started doing this, but it's, well, it's happened now. So, uh, yeah, I'm, I think, I'll, I'll probably, I'm putting Major Arena off for quite a while, but I'll, I will get to it eventually. Uh, it's just, I, I want, I've got a bunch of other things that I want to do. Uh, I'm not a very grindy person. I like to hop around what I'm doing quite a lot. So yeah, th this is fine for me. Oh, that 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 kind of snuck up on me. I I wasn't looking. Seventy three prayer, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Doesn't unlock anything. Oh, well, I, I won't unlock anything until I actually like get rigor and augury. I finished all of my installed heads, but I was slightly off the level. So uh, there we go. There is seventy four prayer. And there is the first herb lore level, 72, this means I can make ranging pots now. Uh, so I can use them when I get to that. Uh, but yeah, I'm making my way through these. I am using amulets of chemistry because may as well get the extra dose, it doesn't really make much of a difference, but hey, it's pretty good. Okay, so I made m most if not all of the potions that I could with the stuff that I had in my bank. I didn't make these. Uh, but I just collected all of the white berries that I need to finish off all of my Cadentine potions uh, Which will mean that all I will have left is uh, Dwarf weed, Lantadime, Avento, I'm not going to do those because those are going to go into brews uh, Rana and Haralanda So I'm, I'm getting close towards the end I, I've, I've been doing this quite a lot, but yeah Also I got myself to exactly 200k, that's pretty cool And that is 73, that means I can now use Botanical Pies to boost to make myself um, uh, what, what the hell are they called? Staminas. Also, extra strong weapon poison potion. Uh, that's that's not the super strong one, is it? Hang on. So, oh yeah. So that that's just P plus. Uh, I might go make myself some of that, just because uh, I'm currently using a standard dragon dagger and a may as and there's a may as well. I I think I actually have this stuff. I I don't know how to make coconut milk, but I'll take a look. Using simple logic, I've managed to figure out what you do. You just have to hit a coconut with a hammer and then use a vial on it. But this is an item that I never knew existed. A coconut shell. I've, I've never seen one of those before. In the sake of science, I'm going to alk it so that everyone knows how much a, a coconut shell alks for. I'm going to assume zero. Yeah. Rip nature rune. Haha. <laughs> Don't tell me what to do. Okay, so now that I've got my stamina, I'm actually gonna uh, start doing the maid training arena. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? What am I going for? This again. How much does it cost? Uh, 200 telekinetic, 300 alchemist, 2000 enchantment, 200 graveyard. Uh, hang on, why are they in? Why are they in different orders? Game be fixed. Right. Okay. Uh, so I don't know what which one I'm gonna do first. I I've got the fire stuff on. Let's go do alchemist first. Okay, never mind. I realized I'm an idiot. I've got an inventory full of stamina parts right now. Uh, I don't know if this is actually going to get me any points. Uh, no, I didn't. 
Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go do telekinetic first because that'll use up some of my stamina pots, and depending on how much I have left, I will. Uh, which one's telekinetic? This one. I will go bank some more, I guess. Okay, and this is gonna be the last telegrab that I will need to do uh, until I come back for the master wand. Uh, there we go, that is 320, uh, the 4 doesn't matter, 320 telekinetic points. A84, that means I can now plus 4 boost with one of the magic potions that I have to do, uh, is it onyx enchant? Uh, which will mean I get more points when I'm doing enchantment room. That, uh, that's, that's why I left enchantment room until the end, because I wanted to try and get that level so that I could do it a bit quicker. Uh, oh no, please don't say that ruined my st Oh no, my stack was so perfect. Oh, I'm sad now. Alright, and with this deposit I'm going to get a massive XP drop and finish alchemy. 20k, that's pretty cool. So yeah, that is 420 alchemy points, so that is the end of the alchemy room. Alright, so I have 161 graveyard points, but I've completely run out of nature runes. Alright, and that is graveyard done as well. Hang on. Uh, oh well, graveyard done for bones to peaches, 201. So it's next. Next, it's uh, enchantment. Right after they've changed this, this is so much nicer. Like you used to have to run around and grab all of the uh, dragon stones, but now you can just do this. And I'm getting six points every time I enchant one of these. And if I am enchanting the one that's the bonus, I get an extra two. So you get put. You still get points super quick. It's just, it's still slightly slower than dragon stones, but it's so much easier. You don't have to worry about contesting with bots, and even if you're not doing the right one, you still get a good amount of points. So I'd say the best method is probably just to sit in a corner uh, where there's these where there's two different types. Also, when you deposit in a full inventory of orbs, you get like three death runes or three cosmic runes. Uh, so I, I personally cannot be bothered with that, so I'm just going to drop them and get the points a bit quicker. Nice, it's the red one again. Right, enchantment is super quick, so I'm fairly sure I have enough. Uh, I need 200, 200, 3000, and 300. Find myself Bones to Peaches. Yes, right, okay, I can use Bones to Peaches now, so... Uh, I'm probably going to do some other things, but I think I'll do enchantment first before I go back to graveyard. May as well finish on the one that I don't like. Okay, I apparently wasn't paying enough attention and I went nearly 200 points over. Uh, enchantment is just incredibly quick. Okay, but now now we have graveyard. Uh, since I have bones to peaches, it's going to be a whole lot nicer. Uh, what runes do I need? Same, I just need to grab my natures. Oh, bollocks, I'm out of natures. Oh, I, I feel like I should just quickly make this clip. Uh, the reason that Bones to Peaches is so good in uh, the graveyard area is not because you get more points for depositing them, uh, it's because you can heal better. So don't bother using Bones to Peaches to actually get points, because you get no matter what fruit you put in there, you get the same amount of points. But Bones to Peaches heal 8 instead of 2. So yeah, just just so you know. And that is graveyard completed. Uh, if you remember, I only had like 101 uh, nature runes, so I only actually use like 80 to get 120 points. So you don't use up very many uh, nature runes with the uh, graveyard room, but you do use a lot, uh, a lot, a lot with the uh, alchemy room. But this should be enough to buy myself the infinity boots. Hey, there we go. Right, uh, this is gonna like ah, look at that dude. I'm I'm super proud of myself. The these are gonna be best in slot until 91 Slayer, so that that's another pretty good gear upgrade. Uh, I think if I destroy this, it gets rid of the points, and there's no point doing that. It's uh, it'll save me a short amount of time in the future if I ever come back to the master one. But yeah, I'm done with the major now.